Nature does not hurry, yet everything is accomplished. This profound statement from Lao Tzu, an ancient Chinese philosopher, resonates deeply in our fast-paced modern world. In a time where the speed of life seems to only increase, leaving us in a perpetual rush, these words echo a timeless wisdom, a call to a different way of living and thinking. But who was Lao Tzu? And why do his words still hold such power and relevance? Lao Tzu, often considered a contemporary of Confucius, is the reputed author of the Tao Te Ching, a foundational text in Taoist philosophy. His name, which translates to Old Master, is shrouded in mystery and legend. Some believe he was a court record keeper, others think he may not have existed at all. Yet, his influence is undeniable. The Tao Te Ching, composed of 81 short verses, is a masterpiece of philosophical thought providing guidance on governance, personal conduct, and the very nature of existence. Taoism, the philosophical and spiritual tradition Lao Tzu founded, centers around the Tao or the Way. This concept, though elusive, refers to the intrinsic underlying principle of the universe, the natural order of things. Taoism teaches the virtues of simplicity, humility and compassion. It advocates for living in harmony with the Tao, leading to a life of balance, peace and wisdom. In today's world, where complexity often leads to stress and disconnection, his teachings offer a refreshing perspective. We live in an era of unprecedented technological advancements and societal changes. Our days are often filled with a relentless pursuit of success, a constant bombardment of information and a societal push towards materialism. This modern life, for all its advancements, often leaves us feeling empty, rushed and out of touch with ourselves and the world around us. This is where Lao Tzu's ancient wisdom becomes not just relevant, but essential. His teachings invite us to pause, reflect and realign with our natural state. They urge us to embrace simplicity in our thoughts and actions, to be flexible and adaptable like water, and to understand our intrinsic part in the natural flow of life. By adopting these principles, we can find a path to a more harmonious and fulfilling life, even in the midst of modern chaos. We will embark on a journey to explore these profound teachings. We'll delve into his key concepts, unravel their meanings, and most importantly, we'll discover how we can apply these timeless principles in our daily lives. From understanding the art of living simply to learning the power of flexibility and the importance of naturalness, our exploration will provide practical insights and tools for personal growth and inner peace. As we navigate through Lao Tzu's teachings, I invite you to keep an open mind and heart. Whether you're well acquainted with Taoist philosophy or new to these concepts, there's something in his wisdom for everyone. This is more than just a historical or philosophical lesson. It's a guide to living better, more meaningful lives in a world that often seems to move too fast for us to catch up. Delving deeper into the heart of Taoism provides us with a profound understanding of a philosophy that is not just a set of beliefs but a way of living. Its origins, rooted deeply in the fertile intellectual soil of ancient China, have blossomed into a worldview that offers timeless wisdom. The emergence of Taoism as a formalized philosophy is often attributed to the tumultuous period in Chinese history known as the Warring States era. A time marked by social upheaval, political strife, and a quest for answers to life's deeper questions. It was during this period that the foundational texts of Taoism, including Lao Tzu's Tao Te Ching and Zhuangzi's writings, were composed, offering a stark contrast to the prevailing ideologies of the time. 
Central to Taoism is the concept of the Tao, often translated as the Way. The Tao is an enigmatic, all-encompassing force, the ultimate reality from which all existence flows. It is both the source and the pattern of life, indefinable yet present in everything. The Tao is not a god or a supernatural being, it is the natural order, the rhythm of the universe, that Taoists strive to understand and align with. In Taoism, the ideal state of being is to live in accordance with the Tao, a state often described as Wu Wei. This concept, typically translated as non-action or effortless action, is one of the most misunderstood aspects of Taoism. Wu Wei does not advocate for passivity or laziness, but suggests an approach to life that is in harmony with the natural order, where actions are performed without unnecessary struggle or resistance. Another key aspect of Taoist philosophy is the concept of yin and yang. This is the idea that all aspects of life have opposing but complementary forces. Yin represents the feminine, passive and receptive force, while yang represents the masculine, active and assertive force. Taoism teaches that harmony in life is achieved through the balance of yin and yang, recognizing that these forces are interdependent and continually fluctuating and influencing each other. Taoism also places a strong emphasis on simplicity and humility. It teaches that true contentment and happiness come from living simply, valuing experiences over material wealth and finding satisfaction in the ordinary aspects of daily life. This simplicity is not about deprivation, but about finding the essence and richness in living a life unburdened by excess and superficial desires. Moreover, Taoism views nature as a teacher and a guide. The natural world in its unaltered state is seen as an expression of the Tao, and by observing and learning from nature, humans can better understand the Tao and live more harmoniously. This reverence for nature has influenced Chinese art, poetry and landscape design, emphasizing natural beauty and balance. The impact of Taoism on Chinese culture and philosophy is vast and enduring. It has shaped artistic expressions such as calligraphy, painting, and poetry, emphasizing spontaneity, simplicity, and the harmony of form and function. In Chinese medicine, Taoist principles guide the understanding of health and disease, focusing on the balance of energies within the body and the importance of living in harmony with the natural world. In the realm of politics and governance, Taoism has advocated for a style of leadership that is in accord with the Tao. This approach favors minimal intervention, governing by example, and allowing people to live their lives with as little interference as possible. Such ideas were revolutionary in their time and continue to inspire modern political and social thought. As Taoism spread beyond China, it found resonance in the Western world particularly among those seeking an alternative to the materialistic and fast-paced modern lifestyle. The Taoist emphasis on inner peace, living in harmony with nature, and understanding the deeper aspects of existence appeals to people searching for meaning and balance in their lives. The universal themes of balance, harmony, and the natural flow of life in Taoism speak to a global audience. In the realm of personal development, the Taoist approach to life, embracing simplicity, fostering flexibility, and seeking balance, provides practical guidance for navigating the complexities of modern existence. In essence, Taoism is more than a philosophy or a religion. It is a guide to living. Its teachings, rooted in the observation of nature and the understanding of the Tao, offer a path to a life that is balanced, fulfilling, and in harmony with the world. As we continue to explore Lao Tzu's teachings, these principles of Taoism provide a rich context, helping us to understand and apply ancient wisdom to our contemporary lives. Continuing from our exploration of Taoism, let's now delve into the core teachings of Lao Tzu, 
particularly those encapsulated in his seminal work, the Tao Te Ching. This text, revered for its profound wisdom, is a cornerstone of Taoist philosophy and provides invaluable insights into his thoughts and teachings. The Tao Te Ching, often translated as the Book of the Way and Virtue, is a collection of 81 short, poetic verses. It is a work of profound depth, encapsulating the essence of Taoist philosophy in its enigmatic and often paradoxical verses. The text, written around the 6th century BCE, has been a subject of continuous study and interpretation, not only for its philosophical and spiritual insights, but also for its literary elegance. The mystical poetry of the Tao Te Ching is not just an intellectual exercise. It invites readers into a meditative reflection, encouraging a deeper understanding of life's mysteries and the Tao. One of the central teachings of Lao Tzu is the virtue of simplicity. This is not simplicity for its own sake, but a means to a deeper understanding and a more fulfilling life. In the Tao Te Ching, he advises reducing personal desires and ambitions, advocating for a life that is unencumbered by excessive materialism and superficial distractions. This simplicity is a pathway to inner peace and clarity. It is about finding contentment in what we have, reducing the clutter in our minds and lives, and focusing on what truly matters. In today's fast-paced and consumer-driven world, this teaching is particularly poignant reminding us of the value of a simpler, more intentional way of living. He often used the metaphor of water to illustrate his teachings, particularly the virtue of flexibility. Water, in its natural state, is soft and yielding, yet it can carve through solid rock over time. This metaphor is a powerful illustration of the strength that lies in flexibility and adaptability. He teaches that the most effective way to deal with life's challenges is not through forceful opposition, but by being flexible, adaptable, and resilient. This approach, like water, allows us to find our way around obstacles, adapting to circumstances while maintaining our essence. Living in harmony with nature is another key tenet of Lao Tzu's teachings. He saw the natural world as a manifestation of the Tao and believed that humans, as part of the natural order, should live in accordance with it. This harmony is not just about an external alignment with the natural environment, but also an internal balance within ourselves. He encouraged a way of life that is in tune with our true nature, advocating for a lifestyle that is not forced, but flows naturally from our inherent being. Lao Tzu's teachings are not mere philosophical musings, they are practical guidelines for living. The principles of simplicity, flexibility, and harmony with nature are not only ideals to aspire to, but are actionable practices that can be integrated into daily life. Embracing simplicity can mean decluttering our physical spaces, simplifying our schedules, and focusing on essential values. Practicing flexibility involves developing an open mind, adapting to change, and responding to life's unpredictability with calmness and resilience. Living in harmony with nature can manifest in sustainable living practices, spending time in natural settings, and aligning our lifestyles with the rhythms of the natural world. The wisdom of Lao Tzu, as captured in the Tao Te Ching, offers a timeless guide to a life of balance, contentment, and harmony. These teachings, when applied, can help navigate the complexities of modern life, providing a path to inner peace and fulfillment. As we reflect on these profound insights, we find that they are not just historical artifacts, but living wisdom that continues to resonate and guide us even in the contemporary world. Building upon the teachings of Lao Tzu, 
Let's delve into one of the core tenets of his philosophy, the pursuit of simplicity. This principle, deeply rooted in Taoist thought, holds significant relevance in our contemporary world, especially in the face of rampant consumerism and the constant pursuit of more. In Taoism, simplicity is not merely an aesthetic choice or a superficial reduction of possessions, it is a profound principle that advocates for a deeper understanding and approach to life. His teachings encourage us to peel away the superfluous layers that cloud our vision and distract us from the essence of life. He prompts us to question the relentless pursuit of material wealth and social status, urging us instead to focus on the richness of our inner lives. Today's world is characterized by an unprecedented level of consumerism, the constant bombardment of advertising, the allure of the latest technologies, and the societal pressure to conform to certain standards of living have led to an accumulation of not just physical possessions, but also mental clutter. This endless pursuit often leaves individuals feeling empty, stressed, and disconnected from their true selves. His advocacy for a simple life is thus more relevant than ever. It offers a way to counterbalance the materialistic tendencies of modern society and find contentment and fulfillment in less. Lao Tzu believed that by reducing our desires, we could achieve a state of tranquility and contentment. This does not imply abandoning all ambitions or living in austerity. Rather, it means recognizing and focusing on what is genuinely necessary and valuable. Living minimally is about making conscious choices to own and do less, yet enjoy more quality and richness in life. It is about finding freedom and liberation from the incessant need for more, and instead cherishing the present and the simple joys it offers. Actionable tips for embracing simplicity. 1. Decluttering physical spaces. Start with your immediate environment. Declutter your home and workspace, keeping only those items that serve a purpose or bring joy. This physical decluttering can lead to a clearer mind and a more peaceful living space. 2. Mindfulness practices. Incorporate mindfulness practices into your daily routine. Activities like meditation, deep breathing, and mindful walking can help in staying present and appreciating the simple moments of life. Mindfulness encourages a deeper connection with oneself and reduces the urge to seek fulfillment in external possessions. 3. Prioritizing what truly matters. Take time to reflect on your values and what you consider most important in your life. Prioritize relationships, experiences, and personal growth over material possessions. Invest time and energy in activities that enrich your soul and bring long-term happiness. 4. Conscious Consumption Become more aware of your consumption habits. Before making a purchase, Ask yourself if it is necessary, if it adds value to your life, and if there are more sustainable alternatives. This conscious approach to consumption can significantly reduce unnecessary expenditure and waste. 5. Embracing nature. Connect with nature regularly. The natural world, in its inherent simplicity and beauty, can be a powerful reminder of the joy of living simply. Time spent in nature can rejuvenate the mind, body, and soul, and foster a deeper appreciation for the simple things in life. 6. Digital Detox In an age dominated by technology, regularly taking time away from digital devices can provide mental clarity and reduce the noise of constant connectivity. Periodic digital detoxes can help in reconnecting with oneself and the immediate physical environment. 7. Cultivating Gratitude Practice gratitude. Focusing on what you are thankful for rather than what you lack or desire can shift your perspective towards contentment and appreciation for the present. 8. 
Simplifying Goals and Tasks Break down your goals and daily tasks into simpler, more manageable components. This approach reduces overwhelm and allows for a more focused and peaceful way of achieving objectives. 9. Quality over Quantity In both possessions and experiences, value quality over quantity. Cherish and care for the items you own and seek experiences that bring deep satisfaction and joy. Embracing simplicity as advocated by Lao Tzu is not about diminishing the quality of life, but about enhancing it. It's a journey towards unburdening ourselves from the unnecessary, focusing on what truly matters, and finding harmony and fulfillment in the simplicity of life. In our next segment we will explore how the Taoist principle of flexibility can be integrated into our daily lives offering a path to resilience and adaptability in a constantly changing world. Continuing our exploration of Lao Tzu's teachings, let's turn our attention to another foundational principle, flexibility. This concept, central to Taoist philosophy, is beautifully encapsulated in his metaphor of water, an element that is soft and yielding yet possesses immense strength and resilience. This metaphor holds profound implications for how we approach life, especially in our fast-paced and ever-changing modern world. In the Tao Te Ching, he writes, Nothing in the world is as soft and yielding as water, yet for dissolving the hard and inflexible, nothing can surpass it. This poetic imagery of water serves as a powerful metaphor for the strength found in flexibility and adaptability. Water flows, adapts to the shape of its container, and overcomes obstacles not through force, but through persistence and yielding. It represents the Taoist ideal of resilience and strength through flexibility. In today's world, characterized by rapid technological advancements, social changes, and environmental shifts, the ability to adapt is more crucial than ever. The pace at which new information and situations arise can be overwhelming, often requiring quick adjustments and a flexible mindset. Lao Tzu's metaphor of water encourages us to approach these changes not with rigidity or fear, but with the adaptability and fluidity of water. This means being open to new experiences, willing to change course when necessary, and finding strength in the ability to flow with life's changes rather than resist them. Flexibility, as a way of life, can be cultivated through various practices and mindsets. 1. Embracing change Begin by accepting that change is a natural and inevitable part of life. Instead of fearing or resisting change, embrace it as an opportunity for growth and learning. 2. Openness to new ideas. Cultivate an open mind. Be willing to consider different perspectives and ideas and be open to revising your viewpoints in light of new information or understanding. 3. Adapting to circumstances. Practice adapting to changing circumstances. This could be as simple as altering your daily routine in response to new demands, or as complex as navigating major life transitions with a flexible mindset. 4. Letting go of rigidity. Identify areas in your life where you hold rigid expectations or inflexible attitudes. Consciously work on letting go of these, allowing yourself to flow more freely with the dynamics of life. 5. Resilience in the face of challenges Develop resilience by facing challenges with a flexible approach. Instead of viewing obstacles as insurmountable, look for creative ways to adapt and overcome them. 6. Mindfulness and awareness Engage in mindfulness practices to enhance your awareness of the present moment. This awareness can help you respond to situations more adaptively, rather than reacting automatically or rigidly. 7. Learning from nature 
spend time in nature, observing how the natural world adapts and thrives through change. This can provide inspiration and insights into how to live more flexibly. 8. Practicing Patience Flexibility often requires patience. The patience to understand that sometimes the best action is to wait and see how situations unfold. 9. Building Emotional Flexibility Cultivate emotional flexibility by allowing yourself to experience and express a range of emotions. Acknowledge your feelings but also be willing to move through them adaptively. Flexibility extends to how we interact with others. In relationships and communication, being flexible means listening actively, being open to others' viewpoints, and being willing to adjust your approach in response to others' needs and feedback. Flexibility, as taught by Lao Tzu, is not a sign of weakness but a source of strength and resilience. It allows us to navigate the complexities and uncertainties of life with grace and effectiveness. Continuing our journey through Lao Tzu's teachings, we arrive at the concept of Ziran, often translated as naturalness or spontaneity. This Taoist principle advocates living in a way that is true to one's inherent nature, embodying authenticity and spontaneity. In our contemporary world, where social constructs and external pressures often dictate our actions and choices, Understanding and embracing Ziran becomes crucial for genuine self-expression and fulfillment. Ziran, in Taoist philosophy, is about aligning with the natural flow of life and one's true self. It's a state where actions are not forced, but arise naturally from an individual's authentic self. He posits that everything in nature inherently follows its own path without external compulsion. Similarly, humans, when in tune with their true nature can live a life of ease and contentment, free from the constraints of artificiality and pretense. In today's society, the pursuit of authenticity is increasingly recognized as vital for personal happiness and fulfillment. Authenticity involves knowing oneself, understanding one's values, beliefs and desires, and acting in accordance with them. In a world rife with social media and its tendency to foster comparison and uniformity, maintaining authenticity can be challenging. However, Lao Tzu's concept of Ziran encourages us to embrace our unique selves and resist the pressure to conform to societal expectations or trends. The journey towards living in accordance with Ziran begins with self-awareness. It requires us to engage in introspection to understand our innate characteristics, tendencies and passions. This self-awareness allows us to live more authentically, making decisions and choosing paths that align with our true selves. In Taoist thought, this alignment leads to harmony, both within oneself and with the world. Embracing Naturalness in Daily Life 1. Introspection and Self-Discovery Regularly engage in introspection. Use techniques like journaling, meditation or mindfulness to explore your thoughts, feelings and motivations. Understand what brings you joy, peace and fulfillment. 2. Aligning Actions with Values once you have a clearer understanding of your values and beliefs, strive to align your actions with them. This might mean making changes in your lifestyle, career or relationships to better reflect your true self. 3. Resisting social conformity Be mindful of the influence of societal pressures and expectations. Practice discernment in how you shape your life and make decisions, ensuring they are more a reflection of your true self than a response to external pressures. 4. Embracing individuality Celebrate your uniqueness. 
Recognize that your individuality is your strength and there is profound beauty in being different and true to yourself. 5. Practicing non-attachment to roles and labels. Avoid getting too attached to specific roles or labels as these can often be limiting. Understand that you are a complex, evolving being who cannot be fully defined by singular aspects of your identity. 6. Simplifying life. Simplify your life to focus on what truly matters. This can involve decluttering your physical space, but also decluttering your life from activities, relationships or obligations that do not resonate with your true self. 7. Being present and spontaneous. Practice being in the present moment. Allow yourself the freedom to be spontaneous, making choices that feel right at the moment without overanalyzing or overplanning. 8. Listening to your inner voice. Cultivate the habit of listening to your intuition. Often your inner voice is a guide to what aligns with your true nature. 9. Accepting and embracing change. Be open to change and growth. Understand that as you become more self-aware, your understanding of your true nature might evolve, and that is a natural part of the journey. In relationships, Ziran encourages genuine interaction. This involves being honest in communication, showing vulnerability, and not wearing masks to please others. It also means respecting the naturalness in others, acknowledging and appreciating their unique selves. Embracing Ziran, or naturalness, as taught by Lao Tzu, is about finding the courage to be our true selves in a world that often encourages conformity. It's about aligning our external lives with our internal truths. This journey towards authenticity and self-awareness not only brings personal peace and fulfillment, but also contributes to a more genuine, compassionate and diverse society. In our next segment, we will explore how these Taoist principles of simplicity, flexibility and naturalness can be woven together to form a cohesive approach to living a balanced and harmonious life in our modern context. In our rapidly evolving world, the timeless teachings of Lao Tzu offer profound insights and guidance. His principles, deeply rooted in Taoist philosophy, have the potential to address some of the most pressing issues of contemporary society, from the stress of modern life to the universal quest for meaning and fulfillment. Modern life is often characterized by a relentless pace and a barrage of demands and distractions, leading to widespread stress and burnout. Taoism, particularly the principle of Wu Wei or effortless action, provides a refreshing alternative. This principle encourages us to align our actions with the natural flow of life, reducing the strain of constant striving. By adopting a Taoist approach, we can learn to approach our responsibilities and challenges with a sense of calm and flexibility, leading to a more peaceful and productive life. In a society often focused on material success and external achievements, many find themselves searching for a deeper sense of purpose and fulfillment. Lao Tzu's teachings guide us to look inward and seek contentment in our inner world. The Taoist emphasis on self-awareness and living in harmony with one's true nature can help individuals find a sense of meaning that transcends material possessions and social status. This journey towards self-discovery and alignment with one's intrinsic values can be profoundly satisfying and enriching. Taoism advocates for a balanced lifestyle, avoiding extremes and finding a harmonious middle path. This concept is incredibly relevant in our modern context, where life often swings between excess and deprivation. By embracing Taoist principles of moderation and equilibrium, 
individuals can achieve a well-rounded life that encompasses physical, mental, and emotional well-being. This balanced approach encourages a healthy lifestyle, nurturing relationships, and personal growth. The practice of mindfulness, central to Taoist philosophy, is particularly pertinent in our era of constant connectivity and distractions. Taoism teaches the importance of being fully present and engaged in each moment. Cultivating mindfulness leads to a deeper appreciation of life, improved mental clarity, and stronger emotional resilience. It enables us to savor the richness of our experiences and forge more meaningful connections with others. In a global landscape often marked by conflict and misunderstanding, Taoist teachings on compassion empathy, and interconnectedness can foster a greater sense of global harmony and cooperation. Taoism offers valuable tools for personal and societal transformation. On a personal level, it provides a blueprint for self-improvement, emotional intelligence, and spiritual growth. On a societal level, Taoist ideals can inspire more compassionate and balanced ways of living and interacting in our communities, promoting values of peace, empathy and mutual respect. The principle of flexibility, as taught by Lao Tzu, is especially relevant in dealing with emotional challenges. By cultivating emotional flexibility, we can better navigate the complexities of relationships, work and personal growth. This adaptability allows us to respond to life's ups and downs with a sense of resilience and poise. The ancient wisdom of Lao Tzu, as embodied in Taoist philosophy, holds significant relevance for modern-day issues. By applying Taoist principles, we can work towards personal fulfillment and a more harmonious society. These teachings guide us to live with intention, balance, and mindfulness, offering timeless wisdom that is as applicable today as it was centuries ago. As we conclude our exploration of Lao Tzu's teachings and their profound relevance in today's world, it's clear that these ancient wisdoms offer much more than philosophical musings. They present practical, timeless guidance for living a life of balance, harmony, and fulfillment. The insights gleaned from his words, deeply rooted in the rich soil of Taoist philosophy, illuminate a path not only to personal well-being, but also to a more compassionate and understanding society. In our journey, we've traversed the realms of simplicity, flexibility, and naturalness, uncovering the ways in which these principles can significantly enhance our modern lives. We've seen how simplicity can bring peace in a world of complexity and noise, how flexibility can foster resilience in the face of relentless change, and how embracing our natural selves can lead to authentic and fulfilling lives. These teachings, though ancient, are remarkably pertinent to the challenges we face today. They encourage us to slow down, to reflect, and to align our actions with our deepest values. In a world that often prizes speed and productivity over well-being, Lao Tzu's wisdom invites us to reconsider our priorities and to find beauty in the present moment. As we integrate these teachings into our daily lives, we open ourselves to a journey of self-improvement and inner peace. This journey is personal and unique for each of us, yet it's also universal in its pursuit of harmony and understanding. Whether it's through adopting a more mindful approach to our day, simplifying our lifestyle to focus on what truly matters, or learning to flow with life's inevitable changes, the teachings of Lao Tzu offer a valuable compass. I encourage you, the viewers, to reflect on how these timeless principles can be woven into the fabric of your daily existence. How can simplicity bring more joy to your life? In what ways can you practice flexibility in the face of challenges? 
How will you honor your true nature in a world that often demands conformity? As you ponder these questions, remember his profound words, a journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Let this be an invitation to take that first step towards a life imbued with Taoist wisdom. And as you embark on this journey, I invite you to share your thoughts, experiences and insights in the comments below. How have Lao Tzu's teachings impacted you? What changes have you observed in your life as you've embraced these principles? Let us carry forward the spirit of Lao Tzu's teachings, applying them not just in moments of quiet reflection, but in the very way we live, interact, and engage with the world around us. For in doing so, we not only enrich our own lives, but also contribute to a more peaceful understanding and harmonious world.